up everybody, I'm Starlord, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the mythical volcano Pokemon in Pokemon Brick Bronze. Uh, this is in the new Port Deca update and uh, how you have to get it is kind of tricky and it does take a while but believe me if you follow the guide very good uh, you'll have no problems whatsoever guys. Uh, so don't forget to leave a like on the video guys if you haven't already subscribe to the channel turn on notifications so that you never miss any of my videos uh, such as this one right here. Um, okay getting straight into the guide uh, here we are right now in Port Deca in the main kind of city and uh, what we're gonna do is really quickly go to this little tiny greenhouse right here and uh, when we go inside here there is a lady who really likes to cook and she says welcome to cook's kitchen uh, today we'll be cooking up an every blah 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 sorry about that I want to have my own cooking show someday blah 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 um, bring me one big mushroom and we can get started um, so there you go she actually asks you can you go and find here this big mushroom uh, you would think it's pretty simple but no it's actually really harder than you think I was nearly crying trying to do this um, Okay, so the first thing that we will need to do, guys, is we need to have a Pokemon with a very special ability. And uh, this Pokemon can either be a Noibat or it can be a Shuffit, I believe it's called. Shuffit, there you go. And uh, this ability is actually called Frisk. And what it'll do is once you actually get into a fight with a Pokemon, it will kind of detect whether that Pokemon's got an item like attached to it and uh, that's how we find the big mushroom basically yeah so yeah it's it's a lot more harder than it sounds anyway so what you want to make sure is that you have a shuppet with uh, the ability frisk or you have a noibat with the ability frisk guys um, and once we've done that what we're gonna do is catch specific pokemon uh, so the first pokemon is going to be um let's see uh, the first Pokemon is going to be at Rose Cove City. So we're just going to fly over to Rose Cove really quick, guys. Shut up, phone. I've done that like five times tonight, honest to God. Uh, so once we're in Rose Cove City, what we need to actually do is, with our Shuppet in our first slot, is run up and down this little uh, kind of wavy part right here where the waves like can make you encounter Pokemon. And we need to find a... Oh, God, Jesus. Jesus, thank you very much. We need to find a star you Anyway, so that was pretty... That was pretty good, because, yeah, we, we need to find you right there, Staryu. Uh, and the Staryu must have a, a certain thing attached to it, and uh, the item has to be Stardust. So make sure that you find a Staryu with the item Stardust. Um, so, yeah, that's the first item that we need. So it's a Staryu with Stardust. And then if we continue going down this way, uh, right underneath the bridge right here, uh, Pash Rove Cove. Uh, Rove Cove? Ro 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 Ro. I'm so tired, so I have to apologize about the slip ups, guys. But I've been up all night creating guides for you guys, and uh, yeah, I'm really, really tired. And I have a son to look after too, uh, who is awake right now. Um, okay, so here uh, in this patch of grass right here, you will actually encounter a Paris and you can only encounter Parises uh, of a daytime and also it's a 5% chance to find the item that they need to be holding. Uh, other than a Paris, you can actually get, uh, catch a Shroomish of a nighttime which has the item Big Mushroom. So we need to find either a Shroomish or a Paris with the item Big Mushroom. Uh, star you with the item uh, Stardust and also a Rattata with the item Chilean Berry. Uh, Rattatas can be found pretty much on uh, the first route, I guess it is. Uh, but I'm not too sure. And I also have to say thank you very much to Haru for finding these items for me. Dude, you are a wonderful, awesome dude. And this guy would not have been able to be completed without you. Um, Okay, so once we've actually got every one of those uh, different items and everything, what we're going to do is we're going to go to our menu, go down to bag. We're going to click on the Pokemons and click take items. We must have to take the items. And uh, once we've then done that, guys, we'll now be able to fly back to Port Deca. 
and go and talk to the lady that wanted these ingredients. Um, after that, I'm really on my own. I don't know what happens after that, but I do know that it will get us a volcano. and uh, yeah, let's try it. Okay, so we'll be cooking up this and that and that and this and this and poop and poop. I like poop and I want to make some poop for you. Do, can I use your poop? Yes, of course you can. There you go. Um, Next, she needs a chillion berry, which is the one from Ratata, so remember guys. And then lastly, we need some stardust from uh, from the actual star me. And uh, there you go, she says, awesome, let's have this or whatever, whatever. Thank you for all your help, I want you to have this. And she gives us a Ipishine ep ep a pine shroom? Oh yeah, it's a pine shroom, okay. Wish you the best of luck on your endeavors, that's all she says. Okay. So that's pretty good, right? And uh, what we're gonna do now, guys, is even though it didn't really do anything, we're gonna fly over to Brimber City. So just kind of hop on down there. And um, let's see, I guess we're kind of on our own right here. I guess it's this dude we have to talk to. Let's see, I've been training, uh, I'm tired and hungry. Oh, there you go, okay, so he wants an epper, uh, yeah, okay, so can I have yours? Yes, of course you can. Thanks. Oh man, I can't believe how good this is. I can feel my adrenaline rushing now. Rawr! And then, wow, okay, he... Wow. You're pretty strong, man. You're pretty... You're pretty strong, man. Okay, so he's actually just, uh, broken the rock. And, uh, now we can head down into the actual thing itself. Um, so now we're in the steam chamber and we can actually encounter Pokemon. That is so weird. Oh my lord. Oh my lordy. Oh my lordy lordy. Um, okay, so we're, we have to go down here. Uh, let's see what are the Pokemon that we can actually encounter down here. Oh, a Camperrupt. Uh, ca Camerupt, I think it is. Yeah. Okay, so a Camerupt and uh, Let's see, there must be more Pokemon that we can encounter down here. This is uh, pretty interesting. Oh, wow. Um, Mag Cargo. Mag Cargo. Mag Cargo. That's, That's what it's called. Mag Cargo. Uh, so it's a lot of evolutions down here, actually. Uh, but if we keep... Whoa, what? What? There's more? Oh, Jesus. Um, okay. <laughs> I didn't expect more out of this cave. Nathan's coughing, but he's okay guys. Don't worry about him and uh, we're gonna get to bag really quickly guys I'm going to put on a max repel There you go. Okay. Thank you very much And we're also gonna put the uh, Pokemon as our thunderous cuz like higher levels and stuff and uh, We're gonna take a little look around. Oh <gasps> There he is He's right there. Okay. Wow. We can't go through that way. Why can we not go through that way? Oh, do we Oh, we go through here we can see him though. I can see him right over there, guys. Oh my god, this is sick. This is amazing. Um, okay, and then we're gonna go here, and uh, let's see. I I was just hoping that maybe I would be able to kind of glitch lord it. Can I? Um, yeah. Okay. There. There you go. Okay. Glitch lord is glitched. No, did I do anything? Okay, I don't think I can glitch this one, guys. Um, well, well. anyway, let's just go the normal route down this way. Um, and we're not going to glitch it today. So we're going to keep on going through these little caverns. Oh my god, that's beautiful. That looks nice. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, okay, so this is like a, a lot of walking just for one Pokemon. I mean, we saw who it is, so this is kind of pointless, the walkie-walkie stuff. Uh, but either way, we are now here in Volcanon's little lair, and uh, look at that, oh my god, what a nice contrast, because yes, this Pokemon is actually a fire and a water type, so, uh, wow, okay, pretty, pretty darn awesome, I'm just gonna get myself a little, uh, uh, let me see, let's see if I can kind of uh, get myself a little uh, screenshot there for the Thumbnail, I guess. Uh, hopefully that's okay. There you go. And uh, yeah, guys, dude, that is pretty much it on how to get Volcano for your Pokemon Brick Bones character. Uh, let's see, do I have... Uh, do I actually have row powers on right now? I do. I wonder if... Do I have save on right now? Let's see. So, auto save is on. Oh, 
Auto saves on, so I've already messed this up for Haru. Um, but I'm gonna encounter it. Please, please be a shiny. Oh god, it's not a shiny. Okay, well there you have it anyway guys. Uh, it wasn't a shiny Pokemon, but still it is a very awesome Pokemon. And uh, yeah, I do hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. And I wish you all the best of luck with getting a shiny Volcano, because it looks absolutely amazing. Uh, but anyway, thank you so much for watching guys. And until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.